Good morning, folks. We're going to go over a brand new cosmological survey detailing distant reaches of the universe. We'll also take a better look at the big filament eruption from yesterday morning. We also have the last day of space weather, and we are starting with our star to find a much quieter last 24 hours by comparison. No significant flares or eruptions the last day. The first small CME hit our planet's magnetic field last night, but it was a weak impact, not to mention a glancing blow. No geomagnetic storms from it. That may not be the case, however, when the next one hits. We recall in yesterday's video, the massive plasma filament released and broke out into space. We had been watching this one in case it left the corona, and indeed it did, but didn't yet have the coronagraph images yesterday morning to diagnose the eruption. Both SOHO and the Enlil spiral updated yesterday, and we are pretty sure we have our answer. SOHO shows the wide breadth of the CME, and this kind of halo certainly tells us we have something coming. It is a wide burst, not terribly dense, which is a good thing, but it should make impact to Earth tomorrow night. Enlil spiral shows another glancing blow, and this one should be a little bit stronger than the one that hit last night. We'll be watching. Let's go next to the background information for the cosmological layout, Laniakea, the Perseus-Pisces cluster, flanked by the dipole repeller and the great attractor and Shapley attractor. Many of you will recall this visualization based on enormous amounts of data on galaxy positions and trajectories, a pure flow system in the cosmos. But what's off to the side? Now, we have the answer to what's off to one side, the Boetti supercluster and density ring of galactic groups. The same team has done the analysis on that one for detailed Cosmo location, and they have a brand new visualization to come with it. While the astronomers may have great confusion about everything from individual nova events on stars to the universe timeline to what has shaped that universe form over the eons, they are getting very good at mapping what's there now. Lastly, folks, still time to get tickets to our event just a week away. Looking forward to seeing many of you out there. Link to that one is found below, along with the link to get our e-magazine. Latest issue came out last night. These cover all the top stories of the last month and is both the best way to support the observers and the best way to stay updated on the many things we cover here in the daily shows. We greatly appreciate your support. Links are found below the video. We'll do this all again tomorrow right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.